Well, hi there, everybody, and good Tuesday morning to you. Meteorologist Travis Klineski here, where we have a, a pretty quiet day overall. Today's big question mark is cloud cover. How much cloud cover do we see? We're waking up to clear skies for central and eastern Nebraska. There are already some clouds out west. The question is, how far east do they push? How thick will they be as they move in? The thicker they are, the longer they last, the cooler it will be. If they clear up a little bit, break apart, we'll see warmer conditions. So right now, going with mild conditions, I think upper 60s, low to mid 70s. Kind of Temps can kind of vary either way, just depending on the amount of cloud cover a breezy southerly wind picking back up during the day today warmer conditions out west as those clouds will clear out a little bit quicker we'll see temps into the 80s once you get west of that north flat and mccook line on westward we're looking at some 80s for this afternoon tonight cool but not as cold we'll see partly cloudy skies with a few areas of patchy fog possible by tomorrow morning uh, still kind of have some questions on how thick that will be. And then heading into tomorrow, partly cloudy skies, warmer conditions, not as much wind, a, kind of an easterly breeze, but warmer conditions with highs pushing into the upper 60s or 70s and lower 80s, possibly some mid 80s out west, so kind of that warming trend continuing. Now again, for today, everything does kind of hinge on the amount of cloud cover. I think the chances of more sunshine up north are a little bit better. Uh, low to mid-70s, possibly upper 60s there around Albion and Central City. Warmer to the west where clouds will kind of clear out a little bit earlier in the day. Low 70s to low 80s, warmest out towards that imperial area. Low to mid-70s in the south, maybe upper 60s there around Aurora. And I'll go with upper 60s and lower 70s in the east where clouds will try to move in at least a little bit. For today. So your extended forecast again after today. Today probably the coolest of the next seven days. So that's saying something compared to where we were. Much nicer conditions, much warmer conditions on the way here over the next seven days. Upper 70s for Wednesday and Thursday. That's pretty close to average for this time of the year. A chance of some showers and storms. Slight chance at least overnight Wednesday night to Thursday morning. Not all forecast models are showing it. So that's why it's just a 20% chance. Friday will be a dry day with warmer conditions, highs in the mid 80s, possibly some places getting close to 90, a little more humidity, a strong southerly breeze out there. And by Friday night, a cold front's gonna be coming through and that cold front will bring in a pretty good chance of showers and storms overnight Friday night into Saturday morning. Still some timing issues on exactly what the timing will be on these uh, chances of precipitation. One thing that's also could, or that could be a factor, especially heading into Saturday, is the remnants of what was Hurricane Odile Odell uh, down in the southwest, uh, down it's right now currently over the uh, Baja Peninsula of Cal Peninsula of uh, uh, Mexico. That's going to be moving into the desert southwest, bringing some heavy rains. Some forecast models are trying to bring a lot of that moisture all the way up into Nebraska, especially eastern Nebraska and northeastern Kansas. And if that's the case, that could kind of enhance the rainfall chances heading into Saturday and may even keep these uh, shower chances around a little bit longer into the day. And it would be a heck of a coincidence if remnants of a hurricane would actually impact the uh, game between the Cornhuskers and the Hurricanes on Saturday night. So right now, best chances of rain lingering Saturday in the east, slight chance in the central part of the state. I think our best chances overall will be overnight, Friday night, and early Saturday morning. Should start to clear out by Saturday night leading to some very nice conditions for Sunday and Monday as we wrap up summer and start off fall on Monday. Temps mid-70s for highs, low 50s for lows, lots of sunshine. Looks like beautiful weather as we head into early next week. So there is your forecast for today again. Kind of watching the uh, start of the weekend for those rain chances and nice conditions on the way these next several days to come. So until next time, I'm meteorologist Travis Klineski. Hope you have a great day.